to get the service just like that started. Science editor Steve Newman reports on one person already using the brand new system. Hey, it's me, Lee. And first things, my hair is green. Second, it's February. Hello, February. This month, I've got a big project going on and I'm trying to switch things up. The past two months, January and December, I felt zero motivation to make any art, which everyone goes through, but I'm just not, I'm not interested. I don't want to look at it and I don't want to make anything and I'm just like, bleh. I'm gonna try and combat that with this project I'm gonna be working on and just kind of switching things up and making it a little fresher because I'm just like, ugh, about everything. This month, I want to close my shop. I feel like I've been spreading my attention pretty thin and I haven't been able to focus on even making anything because I'm constantly packing orders or updating Patreon or addressing envelopes for patrons takes me like days to do. And I just wanna eliminate the shop part of that so I can have just like, just a, a smaller amount of things going on. This month I'm working on a mini gallery box. I don't know if you guys have seen that anywhere. There are like three other artists that have done it so far. City Line, M did one. Um, Mayoko did one and Eva Linsky. I'm not sure if that's right. I'm just gonna show you a little Square does other Instagram. It's just a little box of fun goodies that the artist designed. So there's like notebooks, pins, stickers, prints, postcards, stuff like that in them and like a little zine about the artist. I'm working on the theme of baby animals, like springtime animals. That's what I'm gonna be doing. And I did start some, I started this fawn, which I like. And then I started this little wolf. Also started this beaver, which I really don't like, but baby beavers are so cute. Uh, not really into this one, not sure if I'll finish, but we'll see. I'm just gonna keep making stuff until I like things. That's the goal. And I'm just like really confused on what colors I like right now. I feel just like bleh. So hopefully uh, just making stuff kickstarts something here. So I'll catch you guys later, keep you updated. And, um, okay. So this is what I need to do for the mini gallery box by the end of this month. I need a notebook design, so we're gonna be making a notebook. I'm gonna make a few large vinyl stickers. I need a pin design by the middle of the month and not the end, so they have extra time to put that into production. Then we're doing a postcard set, so that'll just be prints and then pics of my workspace and things about me for a zine and third. Definitely this by mid-month. I think I'm just gonna start making stuff. That's kind of what I've already been doing. And then just kind of pick where I wanna put each. I'm not gonna plan out what's gonna be what in advance. When I am making something to be made into something, it's a big failure. So I'm just gonna keep making stuff and then just pick my favorites to apply to each thing. Okay, great plan. Great. I don't know if you can see, but Herc is right there. That little blob. Flew out of my room. Last night I worked on some pin designs for the mini gallery box. I did three. I did a chick, a bear, and a pig. And I just posted them on Patreon to see which ones they like best. I'm, I only posted this an hour ago. These are the designs I did. That's the chick and the pig and the bear. And I was gonna do like two little egg pieces to go with the chick and then like a little flower for this pig to smell. I wanna do a set of two, but I don't know if it's in the budget that we have, so we might not end up doing that. So the chick and the pig were my favorite and it looks like the patrons like the pig the best. The little bear second, which is pretty nifty because I didn't really like the bear. My patrons are so nice. Okay. That's where we're at with the pin. I packed the rest of my orders for my shop. I think I'm gonna close it now. 
or I don't know. I kind of want to leave it open. I'm still on the fence about that. I'll probably leave it open. I've never closed it before. It makes me feel weird. Because people are going to be like, Is there, do you have a shop that I can buy stuff at? And I'd be like, yeah, but it's closed right now for no reason. And I'm going to open it at an undetermined time. So it's kind of easier to just leave it open. I feel okay about it. So I think it's, this is me deciding right now that I'm going to leave it open. But I'm going to go for a walk with Toadie now and drop this stuff off at a mailbox or at the post office and get going. So we'll talk to you guys later. See you, bye, peace, what's up, yeah. Using the brand new system. month now. I've been working on art for the mini gallery box and uh, I'm gonna give you a little update. We did a vote on Patreon on what pin design we liked. The pig won by a landslide uh, like 123 votes to like the other ones got like 20 and 40 maybe. So the pig's gonna be the pin. So we're finalizing that design now. And then I did a couple more paintings. I've been integrating some mixed media stuff. I got up my junior artist uh, oil pastels and my koi watercolors, which I never ever use. And I just kind of mix stuff up. So I did this bear and this donkey yesterday. Oh wait, I did this two days ago and then I did this donkey yesterday. So I'm kind of liking the feeling of these and they have the mixed media stuff on them. So I'll keep you in the loop, man. I did this tiger painting yesterday for Valentine's Day because I love tires. That's how I decided on the tiger thing. But yeah, this one, every, everyone really likes this tiger. So I think I'm gonna do a little shop update soon with prints of that. And then I have some other pieces I wanna make prints of and kind of revamp my shop maybe next month. So today I decided I wanted to organize this room and kind of get things cleaned up and get rid of stuff before I do another shop update because I like to have things perfectly, you know, spick and span before I start something new. Um, so that's what I'm gonna be doing right now. Uh, this is one of my favorite things to do. I love cleaning this room and getting rid of stuff and organizing things. So it's 
It's gonna be a good day. <laughs> I'm still cleaning my area, area, my studio, like work. I've made some changes, it's been good. I don't know why I'm hanging loose. <clears throat> okay. So I organized that big closet over there and then kind of the smaller closet and my drawers a little bit. I kind of just, I didn't do that much. I kind of cleaned off surfaces and tried to make things more efficient for when I'm packing orders because I had a lot of things spread out where it wasn't very efficient. Like I had inventory on this side of the room, inventory in that closet over there, and I would run back and forth. So I'm trying to put all my inventory in the closet. I found these old pouches. I don't know if you guys remember these. I did these like uh, last summer maybe for a show I did. And I uh, finally put them up for sale for my patrons and they are snatching them up real fast. So shout out to my patrons for being awesome and taking these off my hands. I don't know why I've been hanging out in them for so long, but they're gonna go to good homes. Um, so I guess that's what I'm doing today. I'm gonna be packing these up and shipping them. Cool. <laughs> What's up? It's Saturday. I think I'm gonna try to paint something. Baby animal, I'm not sure what yet. I've kind of done the ones I wanted to do and now I don't know what baby animal wise. So I'm just gonna browse the internet for a bit and then maybe paint something. If not, I'm gonna scan in what I've made so far and try and make some test prints for the shop update I want to do next month because I painted that tiger and everyone loved it. It was over there. And was asking for prints so I might just do like a mostly prints shop update next month. So maybe I'll do that, you know? Decided on painting a baby raccoon with some radishes. So we'll see how it goes. I don't know. Uh, I looked up some fruits that are supposed to come out in spring and radishes was one of them and I think radishes are really cute so... This is my first one, but I thought the legs looked weird. Like he was like all condensed in this little space. Cause the reference photo I was using, he was standing on like a little log. I don't know why I followed that. So I did this one, which I think I like better. I like the colors on this one better. This one's a little cleaner and uh, I don't know. I like this one's cute little face, but um, this one wins, I guess. I don't know. I don't really like either. So, you know, they're fine. They're good. Okay.
So my roommate really liked this when I made it, so I framed it and I'm gonna give it to her. Nice. Tony sitting in the sun like a little angel. Tony, you soaking up that sun? Huh? So cute. So last night I made some test prints of some of the pieces I am using for the mini gallery box. You, when you scan artwork in, sometimes you edit it on the computer and it looks right, and then you print it out and it looks completely wrong, so I'm trying to do a test print of every piece I'm gonna send. I'm also making test prints for a shop update I'm gonna do soon. This little tiger dude is gonna be a print soon in my shop. Uh, so I made some test prints last night. I'm about to film a video for my patrons. I do an exclusive video every month. For my $5 tier, I'm gonna do a video about how I make my test prints and kind of how I scan my art and stuff like that. So just plugging my Patreon if you're interested in exclusive videos. I make one every month. Sometimes it's a little vlog, sometimes it's a Q&A, sometimes it's a how-to, you know. So, uh, I mean, so I'm gonna fill that video, so we'll see you later. I'm gonna, um, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, I feel like I had something else to say, but I guess I didn't. Uh, okay, I just finished editing this vlog. I edited it all day yesterday. It was so long, I can't believe it. Thanks for making it to the end if you did, because it, it's like 20 minutes. <laughs> uh, some closing, little, finish up things I'm gonna share with you. First, I want to talk about bagus. They're these reusable bags. They fold up into small little sizes, so I keep them in my backpack, in my front pocket of my small baby backpack, and I use them all the time. I got them from Hansy. It's a local shop here in Cincinnati, and I love Hansy, and I love these bags. They gave me this one, which I loved, and then I went back and bought this one, because I love it. They're awesome, they're huge, they hold everything, and they're really strong. Before I had bags that folded up in my bag, but they weren't strong enough to really hold anything. But I can go to the grocery store and get stuff and fill these things to the brim. They're awesome, I love them. If you want one, you should get one. And I'm a big no plastic bags person. I will carry everything in my hands if I have to, to avoid getting a bag. So if you need one of these, go get one from Hansy. I have a 15% off code. On their website, if you want a little discount, it's Lee15. Head over there and get one, cause look at them. I actually love them. And I encourage everyone to have a bag that you can fold up and bring everywhere to reuse because plastic bags suck. All right. Oh, okay. I have uh, like two more things. Two more things. Mini gallery box is up for pre-order now until the 10th of March. It has prints, stickers, everything I've been talking about in this video this whole freaking time, it's in there. So I will put a link in the description. Go pre-order it before the 10th and get one. Um, they will be for sale after that in April or May. I should know this, but I don't know. I'll just put some text on because I don't know. Yeah, go get that. Go get it. Go, go get one. Go get one. <laughs> um, <coughs> sorry. One more thing. I have a new assistant now. My friend Kyle is trying out being my assistant on just Mondays and she's helping me pack orders and stuff, so all orders are going to be shipped on Monday from now on until we decide it doesn't work anymore. I'm really excited to work with her. She's gonna pick up a lot of the tasks that take up a lot of my time that I've been talking about in this video, so we're gonna see if that works, and that's pretty much it. I'm good. I'm gonna end the video because it's so long. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs up, man. You know what I'm saying? So I'll catch you guys later, and uh, bye. Bye. Bye.
are you doing? <laughs>